Hi, I'm Ram Madhwani. I've just uh, finished directing a film called Nija. I'm also an ad filmmaker, very proudly so. Uh, and um, I'm going to talk about a film called Secrets and Lies by a director who I very much respect and bow down to, uh, whose name is Mike Lee. In boarding school, every Sunday we used to see a movie. So in that 16 millimeter projector, the projector, uh, the prints used to be very bad, and the projector used to, the film used to, you know, sort of. Uh, uh, at a certain point, the sprockets used to tear, and the, because of the bulb, the projector used to, the, the film used to burn, and it would go warp, warp, warp like that, you know. <laughs> and uh, and there, there used to be the smell of burning film, and I think I got high on that smell of burning film. Therefore, my education began in English movies with lots of westerns in in school, and then along with that, there was Jugnu uh, with Dharmendra in it, and there was Yado Ki Barat and there was everything that we all grew up on. And obviously I saw everything. I saw Tarkovsky, I saw Godard, I saw uh, Jean-Pierre Melville, I saw uh, uh, films at the British Council, I saw films at Olympus Francais, I saw everything the world had to offer. And of course I saw Rishikesh Mukherjee and I saw Satyajit Rai, and I saw, every, I saw everybody. What happens with the best films is that uh, it makes you forget yourself and it also makes you remember yourself. Excuse me. What is it, sweetheart? Are you Cynthia? Yeah, I do know. Hello, I'm Hortense. There's a black lady who goes to a very middle-class uh, white mother and says, I am your daughter. And I remember the camera basically uh, uh, or like holding on to that scene where the uh, the, the girl tells her mother that actually this is who I am. I remember seeing that scene and I felt that here is a director who uh, was interested in what Nestor Almendros called as the landscape of the human face. Uh, he's here, that's what he's interested in. Let's look at the landscape of the human face. And then later on what happens is that there is a, a lunch scene where uh, the mother's other son you now she goes and she introduces her black daughter to the entire family. And again, it's, it's a scene where uh, the family is uh, sitting down for brunch. And um, again, the camera basically is there observing a life unobserved. And when you sort of see how the reactions of these people and the different characters, uh, how the brother reacts, how the wife reacts, how the other daughter reacts, and, and what happens to this sort of emotional earthquake that this family faces and how do they deal with it? Uh, it, is, uh, it is a director and actors who are, uh, it feels like as if the actors are living that moment uh, where again you feel, oh my gosh, these are, these are real life breathing characters. Uh, these are not scripted. Of course they're scripted, of course they're acted but they seem to be undirected, unscripted, unacted. And I don't follow Mike Lee's process, I think his process is very different, but there is a certain objective, there is a certain end to that process, which is what I'm interested in. That movie uh, did a lot of stuff inside me. You must subscribe to Film Companion and hit that button, wherever that button is, hit it fast. <laughs>